G'day guys, Menace here with another Ark Survival Evolved Mod Spotlight video and today I am bringing you two separate mods. This first mod, as you can see, oh, that's under the world, as you can see, is the electric fence mod. These are behemoth electric fences. They are huge and I do believe a raptor is here. Say hello, what are you doing little fella? Let's go for a bit of a fly here fellas, and ladies of course, and I'll explain a little bit about these awesome awesome behemoth electric fences now there's bulletproof glass on this side so if you're playing pvp you cannot get shot through these at all and on the other side we have electric fences when these are actually charged so we'll go over to this side these look amazing on the outside they will be charged by obviously a generator and you can see the other mod that we'll look at in just a minute but let's power this up all you need to do is have an electrical generator anywhere Within 100 meters of these, uh, these actual stone fence, uh, sorry, the, the electric fences, and they will be powered. So let's press the E button and check it out. They will be powered, and it doesn't look like the raptor's getting hit from that side, so it's mainly for the larger dinosaurs. I guess that kind of sucks, so we learned something in this video. Raptor not getting zapped, but I'll tell you what, if we walk into this stuff, we get hit. That's half our health, but we are level 1 at the moment, and also there's some cool lights on top. As you can see, the uh, the red lights here. It doesn't look like... Maybe this other one's not powered. Perhaps that's the reason he's not getting shocked. That makes sense. These guys don't look like they're powered. So, 100 meters, maybe not right um, as per the description. So, definitely that is unpowered. But cool thing about these is you can set a pin code. So, you can turn them on and off whenever you need to. Um, set a pin code in here. And if you also... I um, want to, you can pick them up. So if we, uh, we can clear the pink code because I put one on there before. But we can pick up the electric behemoth gate. Now watch this. We <laughs> I don't know why, but it seems that the collision, um, the whole mechanics of it, like when you pick them up. I mean, it's still, it's in my inventory. If you have a look, there it is. There we go, done. So it kind of will sit there until it despawns. I guess just like destroying a normal structure. Now, the other thing I want to look at, oh, is I need to stop hitting these. Let me fix myself. Give me a second, guys. There we go. That feels better. <laughs> Next mod we are going to look at is the Spotlights mod. Now, this is um, a really cool mod for two different types of spotlights. There is a primitive spotlight, which is here, which can be filled up with um, fuel. And actually, we might just split that stack again. And we'll actually light, like, there's a little campfire in there um, that you can light up. You can put gasoline. You can put hatch, uh, thatch, sorry. Uh, you can put in wood, all of the above stuff will work just fine. Now these here are the other kind where they run off power. Oh, by the way, they also have different angles, so you craft them at multiple angles. At the moment, they don't have any ones that you can sort of adjust your own way and whatever, but they do have one work in progress where it is a rideable um, spotlight, so you can sit on it and then aim it everywhere, but it's a little bit buggy, so I didn't want to show that one just yet. But these guys here, these are pretty cool. So we'll open up our uh, power supply here and turn this on. And they, they will light up once we... Um, we need to just turn them on like so. Like your standard lights. And they make kind of, yeah, like really bright. So let's change the time of day to night time. Let's go, I think, uh, let's go with night time. Now you can see there's two types of lights. And they are super bright. They're really bright actually. Didn't even realize... Um, we can kind of go up here and see that, wow, that is ridiculously bright. So anyone will be able to find your base, that's for sure, if you do have this mod on your server. But I really like the, the look of these. I mean, this could really set off your base. And obviously you've got the kind of warmer fire lights here. And that actually does project quite a bit himself. Let's turn off the... Uh, the gener Let's just turn these off here by ourselves and see what the fires do. That is a lot of light for just some wood and thatch that you could put in there. Really like the idea of these ones. And they're super easy to put down, I'll show you. Turn it up. Let's turn some lights on here. All you need is a foundation, and you can just pop them straight on top like this. I didn't I don't think we have any more. Let's just grab one of these. And you can pretty much do it like all the other All of the other items in the game. A click and um, sort of a rotate. So you can put them any way you like, which is awesome. 
So two really cool mods that would work super awesome in your base. I think they would work a lot better, you know, if you could put the spotlights on top. But I'm sure there's some people out there can find a way. Look at the blue at night. Doesn't that look cool? I really like that. And the red light on top, which is awesome. Let's turn all of these on here as well. As always, guys, links in the description for these profiles for the uh, for the workshop mods of these ones. You can put them on your single player world or in your server. As always, if you like these mod videos, please let me know by hitting that thumbs up button. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Let's get in front of this thing. My name is Menace. I'm in the dark. I am the bat. I am the Batman. See you all next time.